Good morning, everybody. Super tired. All my kids are up at 6 a.m. because of the time change. So my kids have school today. I believe it's a Friday and I'm packing up my lunch for my daughter. She has a field trip today. Sometimes she brings a lunch, sometimes she's at school. Um, so since she has a field trip, I'm just making it very simple. Peanut butter and jelly, chips, um, a drink, you know, a couple of sides, maybe a granola bar. Super easy peasy. I don't really do anything fancy ever, um, but this is it. Over coffee. Um, I've been doing the Starbucks breakfast blend. Sometimes I really crave their coffee and then sometimes it's way too strong and it hurts my stomach. I'm coming. All right, so this creamer is really good. The peppermint mocha. I don't know why I like really, really just love this stuff in the winter and fall. But I try to just do one tablespoon because it's 35 calories and the sugar is the worst part. Cheers. All right, I need you to get shoes on. We're gonna go on a walk. Okay, are you gonna wear your PJs? Yes. yes. I told Grandma this and I picked him up like that. Oh, you picked him up? Yeah, oh. like this, and I hold it like this. Wow, good job. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, we are going on a bike ride. I'm gonna try to walk for like 30 minutes because I need to. Is that Y'all know that I have two cats. Y'all see them in my videos. What are our cats' names? Louie and Lulu. Louie and Lulu. Lulu is our girl. She is a short hair cat. Louie is our long hair cat. And he sheds so much. I'm constantly and mom's trying my, to brush him. And mom's my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> and he just gets dirty. He, my, I know cats groom themselves, Louis. but he gets litter stuck in his and long mommy, hair. Mama, he gets tangled up mommy, pieces. And this is Lucy. Yes, so I have been wanting to get him groomed. I have taken him to get groomed before, kind of like a bath, and it was expensive. It was like 70 bucks. I want to see that. I can't spend that on my cat. So, I have been wanting to try to groom him on my own. I've seen it on TikTok, and I want to try it. He is a very calm, laid back cat. I'm not doing this on Lulu. Where is she? She is not like that, but he is. So. I'm going to give this a try. You might think I'm crazy. Sit right here. Lay down. Don't move. All right. Thank you. We're gonna blend this in. No, no, Luke. Don't get up. All right. This is an at-home groom station. It comes with several different parts. It's super quiet. 
you can groom them and um, it stores the hair here. You can use it for cats and dogs. Okay guys, if you have a cat or a dog that sheds, you have got to consider getting one of these pet vacuums. This device is very compact and it's portable and it is very quiet compared to other vacuums. Having a quiet vacuum is important because a loud one could potentially scare your animal. It did sound a little loud, I think just because it was right next to my camera, but I promise you it's really not. This device is very cool because it has five different attachments. I will put a picture here of all of the different ones, but it has a grooming brush. It has an electric clipper, which I thought was very cool. It has a de-shading tool. It has a cleaning brush and then a crevice tool that you can use to get cat hair off of your couches and things. This was really simple and easy to use and it did not leave any cat hair on the ground or the table. So I'm going to leave a link down below for this. You can grab it with a discount. It's way cheaper than having to pay for a monthly trip to the groomer. Going to get gas, going to the post office. Hopefully Sybil will fall asleep. I really doubt it. No, I'll make a peanut. Okay. Alright Sybil, you ready? All right, the baby is taking a nap. Sybil is watching a movie, drinking my Elani, and I'm trying to do a little bit of work, like hopefully like 20 minutes. Editing a video right now, Thanksgiving meals. If you haven't watched yet, I will link it for you to watch. Actually, not Thanksgiving meals, Thanksgiving side dishes. Okay, Van took a two hour nap. It was great, I put up my video. Um, so now I'm gonna do some cooking. Um, on Wednesday nights, bless you, I help feed um, our church group, like our youth and like all of the kids that come on Wednesday nights. So I'm doing tater tot casserole and I'm making two huge pans of it. Are you hungry? These are like the really large pans. So, one of them I'm gonna add vegetables in I think and then the other one I think I'm not just because some people might be picky um, but side note I bought these at Aldi yesterday oh my goodness like if you are not in the Christmas mood you need to go buy some of this and try it it will put you in the Christmas mood they also make dark chocolate it's so good I don't have to put it away So, I'm gonna video this. I'm gonna get started with the meat because it was in the freezer. And I gotta thaw it and cook it. Doesn't really matter while we 
wishing for something better I try to fix things that weren't broken Misunderstandings and words unspoken We fall apart and I won't dare to say Do you feel So here I am making tater tot casserole. I'm doing it the traditional way, however, I was thinking that some people may not like vegetables in there, so I threw some drained and washed pinto beans in with the meat to help kind of thicken it up and make it more hearty and really you couldn't even tell and none of the kids complained. And then I did make another tray, but that tray had vegetables in it like normal. So all I'm doing is mixing this all together. Then I'm going to layer tater tots on top, put shredded cheese on it, and then I'm going to let it cook in the oven. And it did need to be cooked for a while just because it was so big. But everything's okay. Don't string me along the way you do. Just let me get Okay guys, it is the next day. That's why I'm wearing a different outfit. I'm gonna continue doing some cleaning. I've already done a ton of cleaning and then I realized I should have been videoing this. So we're gonna continue doing laundry and things. Check out this jug I got y'all. $5 from somebody who was selling it in town. I put some lemons and lime and some true lemon in it. It's awesome. I just need a little strap. I'm gonna try to drink this. I'm pretty sure it's a gallon. All right, let's go do some laundry. On this particular day, it was basically a whole ordeal, but I thought that we had bed bugs. And so that's why my couch is completely taken apart. And I moved it, I vacuumed out the couch, I vacuumed the rug, like I was on a cleaning spree. Um, but long story short, we did not have bed bugs, so I just kind of psycho cleaned my living room for nothing, but it's okay. So I'm doing some laundry. Um, I'm currently watching the a Britney Spears documentary, which is really interesting and really sad. Um, but if you've watched it, let me know down below your thoughts because now I want to read her book. So one thing that I do like about our couch, even though it's really old and we could really use a new one, like look, you can see all the cushions are like falling apart. But one thing I do like about this couch is that you can take the cushion covers off and I can put them in the washer and clean them really, really well with like hot water. So that's what I do periodically just because my kids are gross. <laughs> but I'd love a new couch, but right now, you know, we're not getting a new couch because I have little kids and they just mess everything up. All right guys, this is what's for supper. I've actually shared this recipe before. It's really easy. 
It's just um, frozen broccoli, carrots, um, onion, chicken broth, cream, milk, and then you're gonna put Velveeta in it and we're gonna have broccoli cheese soup. Okay guys, I am cleaning my trash can because it smells so bad. Okay, so what I actually did is I let my trash can sit out here for like two days straight because it rained and I poured bleach in both of these and then I drained it out and now I'm using Clorox spray. Um, there's so much food gunk right here. Like I, I spared y'all the details, but I'm gonna clean this up a bit and we are gonna wash this out with a water hose let this dry and then hopefully that will help with the smell that is currently coming from my kitchen. If you have a lunchbox that gets food left in it, it gets moldy, this Clorox with bleach, let it sit. Let it sit. Then you're gonna put a little bit of water, shake it, and then scrub it and it'll be clean. Doesn't really matter while we 
wishing for something better I try to fix things that weren't broken Misunderstandings and words unspoken We fall apart and I won't dare to say Do you feel the same? I was in the cooking mood and my husband bought these cookies from a student so we threw some in the oven and then I was going to share with you all my favorite wine. I do like wine. I don't drink a ton of it but sometimes I do want some. This wine is from Aldi. It's only $3 a bottle and my little tip here is to buy the cab and it's strong. It doesn't have a lot of sugar but sometimes if it's too strong I buy the sweet red wine and I put a little bit in it and it kind of evens out like the wine. All right, this is what it looks like. And if the broccoli is like big, you just have to cut it. And it's delicious. So we are gonna eat this um, tonight. The cookies also turned out okay. One batch was good. This batch I burnt. I like burnt cookies, so it's okay. But that's it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I think it's a long one. But if you are interested in a pet groomer for yourself or for a gift, check out the details down below in the comments. I will put a link with a discount. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, everybody.